Hey guys, what's up? It is me, Ramal's Perth Reunion here, and welcome guys back to some more Let's Play Crash Bandicoot. Last episode, uh, we have completed the uh, first boss of fight of the game. In this episode, I am hoping to uh, make it past through uh, these uh, next two levels, eh? And the, now the one thing I noticed is, just to let you know, I actually have the option of uh, playing as a Coco Bandicoot, which is really great, but I'm, I'm actually going to stick with the uh, Crash uh, Bandicoot, okay? So basically how I do that is I end up going to Coco's uh, time machine, and I press the, uh, the left uh, trigger or right bumper button to uh, access the option, and I actually found that Really, really helpful. Anyways. Uh, oops, I fell off again. I hate that doesn't matter because I got the chest here. Oh, yes. Alright. Oh, so here's TNT. Get out of here. Okay, thank goodness. Because, you know, if I landed it. If I stayed in the TNT for too long, I'm pretty sure I would have died. That was close. Okay. Alright, so that's another Coco Bandicoot token for me. I miss. I, I, mean, I want to make sure I don't miss anything. That's all. All right. Yes, this is what I came here for, man. No problem, man. Nice. Up, up. We won't have to deal with this, okay? Oh, actually, I might, okay? So, yeah. Yeah, those, uh... That, that character with, with the needle in his head looks pretty similar to that of, uh... Of uh, Dr. Neo Cortex, but. But oh well. I have to leave you with that. Okay, but I missed 18 boxes, okay? Ooh, 24, eh? But I'm pretty sure Crash Bandicoot's doing alright. Here, you're actually gonna get introduced to the very first writing level of the game. Okay, and that is none other than Hogwild, man. Now, um, this level, keep in mind, this could actually be pretty tricky, so, because, because of, uh, going the distance against this oh. Oops, I missed one box, but that's not too big of a deal. Okay, okay, I'll take my time and do this. Oh. Okay, at least you got the checkpoint. Not bad. There. Oh, that's better. Thank you. Whoa. Okay, good. Thought I was gonna die there, but oh well. I'm down to 12 lives, so that's not bad. Yeah, riding levels in 
can crash bandicoot games and it's be annoying at times. I mean, it's not as bad as the, uh, as the original PlayStation 1 version, but, but oh well. Alright, okay, I made this far, nice. Okay, good. Oh, I wouldn't make it there. That, that would be great. Do this in a rush. Jump this time. All right. That's nice, I made it. Okay, I missed two boxes, so that's not too bad. Okay, let's see. Uh, so we're going back into Wimpa Island. We got the native fortress, okay. So that's exactly uh, where I'm going to be uh, heading to by the start of next episode, okay? So next time on Let's Play Crash Bandicoot, we're actually going to go into a night the native fortress and hopefully I'll be be able to go access to uh, where this uh, grave statue is going to be so yeah this is Ramos Perthian here this has been Let's Play Crash Bandicoot and I will see you guys all in the next episode good bye